Minister of Social Development and Family Services Donna Cox lamented that the nation must do its part to help empower and transform lives in a meaningful way, which she said will lead to the healing and restoration of families. This upsurge of violence being perpetrated by family members against each other is quite alarming. This vicious cycle of abuse tends to be broken, needs to be broken, and it only can start with us. Crimes of passion are impulsive, and in that moment, most times, it is only the perpetrators who have the ability to stop what is taking place. She said the ministry will continue to pursue initiatives to support faith-based organizations through capacity building, partnerships, and other collaborative mechanisms. We recently hosted one of our virtual information, education, and sensitization session, which we call PIES. Uh, we had that session with the Open Bible Church on the Rock and Mova, and which we want to have with most churches, so that you will be able to point your congregation to the ministry with regards to services that we can offer to them. Minister Cox said based on the frequency of these incidents taking place, it's not a physical war being waged against the family. But it is also a spiritual one. And there is a need to return to the values of honoring and cherishing life and return to putting God at the center of our families. Each year, Pawi hosts a Pentecost rally to bring together members and leaders of the full gospel fraternity throughout Trinidad and Tobago. This year, the theme was Rebuilding Together, Experience the Reconnect, which calls on persons to work together towards common goals. Mahalia Joseph Wharton, TTT News.